Hi everyone, welcome to my channel ICT Active Learners. Today I am here to explain presentation part of IGCSC ICT 2021 February March Paper 2. So you are going to create a short presentation. Our slides must have a consistent layout and format unless otherwise instructed. Slides must be formatted to display a title and a bulleted list. So create a presentation of six slides using the file M21 stores presentation. So first of all, we need to open PowerPoint presentation. Now I need to open the file as they have mentioned. Yes, file, then browse, and at desktop I have a folder and I will open the file which is for presentation, this one. So it has one, two, three, four, five, six slides as they mentioned. Use a slide master or master slide to display the following features. So first of all, view, slide master, go to the first slide and now apply the changes as it is required. So what are the changes? Let's have a look here. Features we need to apply. First of all, slide number in top right. So here is the slide number. I will move this one to the top right. Just like this. Next is a three to four point red line across the slide below the title. So I will need to insert a line and this line is going to be 3 to 4 point below the title they said so we we'll just need to adjust it yeah and now we'll change the color to red and then also the weight is 3 to 4 points so i can choose 3 points here or i can just go to uh, like for example uh, more line options here and then just mention here instead of 3.4 point I just mentioned that and then after we'll just click on uh, save or before this I would like to move there your name center number and candidate number in the bottom left corner so here is the header and footer so I will just write, type my name, then center number, and then candidate number. And this is going to be at the left side. So I will move this one here. This one I will just apply here. And we'll remove the date. We don't need this at all. And then after they said, a filled arrow in the bottom right corner to look like this. So we need to include an arrow, insert, we have here shapes, and then I will choose the arrow, <coughs> sorry, just like this. And we need to fill it with any color. So right now it is filled with the blue. I'm going to fill it, for example, with the gray color, just like this, to the right, okay and then after bottom right corner so it will look like this yeah this is how it will look like okay now if you just move this one down it's much better okay make sure it is not going out of the presentation just like that and the next step is to make sure master slide item appear in the same position on every slide there is no overlap on any slide fine i will just move to a normal slide this is how it look like now right now 
uh, the information that I have inserted it's not appearing here so it means I need to click on header and footer and click on the option slide number and footer apply to all <coughs> now I need to make changes to the footer as my name center number and candidate number apply to all so it is available on every slide so they said it must be at the left so you can simply go back to design the slide view just click here and home align this one the text to the left and now just click on view normal view and then it will look like it just like this <coughs> so sorry we need to go to slide master we'll choose this one and then insert header then you just choose this one apply to all and that must be a left align on all the slides okay these changes should be applied to the original slide yes and then just click on normal view that's all next step is to on the first slide place your name after the text store manager so here just like my type our name and then after moving forward to the next step as they said use the file m21 chart.csv or oh sorry move the third slide with the title purpose of the store to become the second slide so here is we'll move this one to the to become the second slide next step is use the file m21 chart so we'll open this file and we need to create a pie chart in this pie chart we need to include the chart must show the supplier company and the number of product they supply label the chart with the title so let me select the data first and then insert a pie chart simple pie chart so this is how it look like the pie chart then after the chart label and the title uh, title is uh, suppliers this one we change it to suppliers next is label the segment with the company name and values so we need to go to the format or we just need to go to chart elements data labels uh, and with the data so we just need to include the labels also with the data so we just need to get the data only with the labels as well so more data options like uh, values and series name just like that or category name yeah just simply like that and then after they have mentioned do not display the legends so we will remove the legends we don't need the legend to be displayed we remove it yeah and let's make it little bit bigger just like this yeah or you can apply a layout uh, with a different way for example if there is another possible way for example percentages and with data yeah that's much better but it doesn't show the data right now so label with the data 
Or let's go back to the original format that we used before. Yes. So we just need to choose a layout from here like this and then we include the chart title as well and that is called suppliers that's all just make the chart little bit bigger so the data is clearly visible and the next step is to place this chart on the slide with the title our local approved suppliers so just copy the chart and then go to the presentation and our local approved just paste it over here yes include the chart here just like that next step is to apply the same transition between all the slides so we'll click here transitions for example push this one also push yes or you just simply click here and apply the effect option to all yeah just one by one if you just want to check you can apply one by one or to all of them at once just like that to one by one so it is much better so that you know it is applied to every slide of your presentation that's all now next step is print the presentation as hang out with six slides to the page so you need to click on file print option and then you have to choose the option from here that six slides horizontally just like that and you need to print this one and then after you need to print as well the slide with the our local approved supply as a single slide then after you need to choose here uh, one slide or slide and the slide you want to print is this one that's all so you have to print this one as your presentation slide and that's it from the presentation part and here is the evidence so you have already evidence of your work you need to print the evidence and here they say apply the and uh, the transition um, evidence they also want so that's a transition just print screen and then open your evidence document to paste it as evidence number 11 which is the last evidence yes like this and then you have to print it out the evidence and the presentation so hope you have learned something in the presentation part of this question paper thanks for watching please subscribe the channel for more videos and updates